Hi, Jeff Cash and Granger, Borough 1986, out here east of uh, Kalamazoo in Michigan. I'm going to pick up a few geocaches. caches. The first one I'm going to graph to is uh, one that's going to help me uh, fill my fizzy grid. I have one left to fill that fizzy grid up, and it's a four difficulty and a five terrain. And I've spotted this one on the map, so why don't we go and try and get it? Tell me, it's only 127 feet in. And it's good to be in spring weather. The trees haven't broken out yet, so bushwhack won't be as bad as the woods. That's all it is. This one is, uh, like I said, it's a four difficulty five terrain, and uh, it's all stuck in the middle. I'm not can turn it pretty easy. But something tells me. This is not going to be as easy as it looks. Again, four difficulty, five terrain. And things don't look like what they seem to be. This looks like it. I was expecting something a little bit more difficult to find. I'm just going to be curious. I've got a funny feeling this is a replacement container and not in the place it should be. I might contact the cache owner to see what's going down with this. If that's the right place, that was, that's one of the easiest 4 fives or 5 fives I've found. It's uh, a little bit curious. Like I say, I'll contact the cache owner, let them know what's going down, and make sure this indeed is the cache stuck in the middle. After another one, it's uh, called up a tree, so I suspect we'll be doing a little bit of climbing. It has a difficulty of three and a terrain of five, and so let's see if we can make that climb. That one is about uh, 40 feet in. It's like a feeding spot for deer. It's like it's also solar powered. Well, that was tiring. Next one says, uh, watch out for sprinkles. Not too sure what to expect of this one. Somebody just replaced the log. This is always a good deed. Everything good to go. Symbol. This one could do with a little bit of uh, TLC. These are a good series of caches, so I'll reward it by uh, dropping this uh, travel bike so it can. 
a long his way. I came out to uh, geocache and expecting to find a very very difficult cache in order to fill, fill my fizzy grid but that turned out to be quite easy and so just wandered around picking up caches all afternoon lots of discarded shoes this trail is sometimes used for a mud run so I dare say that uh, that's where those shoes are coming from was I right or was I right? Glimmer through the undergrowth and through the leaves. I do believe that's the cash. Yep, there it goes. Let's get a look. walk through the woods and this geocache tells us to look up and so we'll take a look up oh and there it is this looks suspicious Log is right in there. Ain't no bones about that one. Well, my intention this day was to find that final cache to fill up my fizzy grid, the four difficulty and five terrain. Like I said earlier, it turned out to be a lot easier than I thought. And so I noticed there was another nine other caches in this area. And so we made an afternoon of it. Just remember, keep on caching.